Detroit basketball. Detroit basketball. Pistol Mike. Larry O'Brien. It's his sight. Hit that subscribe bell. Don't forget to like it. Detroit Pistol. Pistol Mike. You know what time it is. You here for the update. Pistol Mike keep you informed. Make sure your substrate. So you don't ever go without the info that you need. Let's see the pistons rise. Detroit basketball. What's good, everybody? It's your boy Pistol Mike. Make sure you like, share, comment, and subscribe. Don't cost you anything, not even a nickel or a dime. Let's get into that video. Before you do that, go get that T-shirt. Shout out to Alex for always keeping you updated. So the Pistons are, their media day is scheduled next week, Monday um, at 1.30. Dwayne Casey and Troy Weaver are scheduled to speak. Can't wait to see what they speak. We're going to do a video. We're going to cover we're going to cover the topics on it. It's almost that time of the season. We got three or four weeks away before NBA preseason starts. Um, really less than that. Bro. Yeah, three, week, three weeks away. So it's going to be interesting. It's already that time for the season. I can't wait to see how Dwayne, uh, I mean, Dwayne Casey and what Troy Weaver got to say about this team, this team expectations and all that. We're going to break it down. We're going to talk about it. Um. Can't wait to see what Dwayne Casey said, um, what players been working on over the summer, uh, development going, what the expectation out of the year, and the same with Troy Weaver. I also want to see how no, um, Noel and um, Burks feel about coming to Detroit. Uh, of course, they probably feel like they can help out and bring a veteran presence, but I just can't, can't wait to see um, how they feel about the team and where they going, what direction, and uh, uh, how they feel about Detroit overall. So that's all going to be very interesting. Um, I wonder if Cave will speak or uh, Killian or um, Bay or Bagley, if any one of the players will uh, speak. Hopefully we'll see. We'll, we'll break down what they got to say too, and hopefully I know – that they have a high expectations making the playoffs. We'll see this team. Um, there's a lot of deep teams that's got a lot of depth, who got uh, a lot of depth and got a lot better during this year. But it is definitely interesting to see, be interested to see what they got to say, what they've been working on, and, you know, how they're looking forward to this season and ready to play because it's a long 82 game season. We it is is different, you know. So that is all. I can't wait to see it. I'm ready. I'm ready to go. Um, you guys never know uh, what's gonna happen. So let's all just you know be happy. Yes, we get to see Cade and Ivy in less than three weeks to, today. Let's go. I'm ready to hear Cade. And uh, not, I mean, Ivy and hopefully Durant speak about it and all that, even though they already did with the draft and everything. But I'm just ready to see them young guys on the court. I ain't going to lie. I'm so excited. I'm pumped to see the Cade and Ivy backcourt work his magic to fire ice duo. We is back, baby. D Troy basketball is almost here. So you guys, shout out. To Alex for always keeping me updated. Make sure you go cop that t-shirt in the link in the description. And have a blessed one, man. Peace. Let's go. Detroit morning is part of the culture. To deep base, the trade you on the poster. You know the facts, so why we test the road? Kill and get hate, deadly handles, I'll expose you. Cool composure, team stack to win the chip. Act like I ain't told you. First round tick, had him sick. K Cunningham, ass shot to Duncan, man. I know about y'all, but we come to win. I'm a buzzer grant, they all jumping in. Pissy Mike, we take your flight. Click like and subscribe, we can keep you right.
this fist to the mic.